my name is Ricardo Rios. This is my last semester studying my Bachelor of Business Administration here at FDU Vancouver. I am originally from Caracas, Venezuela. I am 22 years old. And here in FDU, I've been the co-president of the MUN Association. Uh, throughout your times in FDU Vancouver, can you tell us more about your best um, experience or memories here? So, um, yeah, so here specifically in FDU Vancouver, you live like in events that are done by the university, like that's obviously clubs, uh, like uh, I remember like volunteering the Salvation Army with the Road Track Club, or I was talking that I was part of the MUN club as well, all the different meetings that we have with the entire team, or like in the Global Scholars program, when we were doing these events in the student lounge, like Peace Day, and we were doing like pamphlets and everything to create awareness uh, about different uh, events. It was really nice. I feel those are like the best experiences in it. As an international student, what kind of challenges did you face throughout the academic years? And how did you overcome it? The biggest challenge in these four years have been the COVID pandemic. Like because as, as an international student, student, you already have these challenges of like, you're away from home, away from your family, away from your friends. So you have to live all this life where you have to be very responsible with your school assignments and with your exams and all this. And aside that, the fact that there was a pandemic where we all had to isolate and start like, we shifted to online classes and like, it was all very new for us, the students. It was very stressful. So I feel that that was like the biggest challenge as an international student these four years. You have to build habits and you just have to, to adapt and adjust to these uh, difficult situations. But thankfully, like FDU is also helpful, was very helpful in these situations. Like FDU has a lot of professors, advisors, and many other staff that they were very helpful to guide us and help us in any new problem that the COVID pandemic started. Talking with you, you have a job in the university, outside campus, and also balancing a good GPA. How did you do that? So it's, re it's really not an easy job to balance like both the, the part-time jobs and, and studies. And it requires a lot of sacrifice. Sometimes you just have to sacrifice like a Friday night uh, going party with friends or like a weekend going camping because you have this very important school assignment that you have to do or you have to uh, spend some time studying for this very difficult exam. So it just has to be like a little bit of discipline and sacrifice. But like, there are ways to minimize that sacrifice, and that's basically organizing yourself. But like, if you organize your schedule, be able to have a little bit of sacrifice, but also being able to just enjoy your student life. So, what are the things you like to do in Vancouver? Go um, places uh, to eat and drink. It's like a very multicultural city, so our, there are very different places. You can have like a, a street where you have a Mexican restaurant over here, and next to it there's like a Mediterranean restaurant. It's so nice to be able to try different flavors and different things. It's, that's like the whole year, but I think my favorite time in Vancouver is in the summer because the weather is so nice and there are so many things that you can do here, like go to the beach or I really like playing soccer and volleyball. So That's all the question I have for today. Uh, thank you so much for being here with us, Ricardo. Thank you very much for inviting me and good luck to everyone in this semester. Have a good one.